The Energy School Awards are given to creative and innovative individuals and teams in recognition of their outstanding contributions to the education service. In particular, the award is a tribute to MOE staff who have spent time, energy and resources to generate, develop and implement creative ideas to address important challenges at the school level. They can be proud that their contributions have benefited their students and schools. Let's hear from some of our winners. Badok North Secondary School is one of our Bronze Awards winners. The project eliminates the production of more than 46 kilograms of battery waste each year, contributing to environmental conservation efforts. Listening comprehension examinations are usually run on radios that use these size batteries. The disposal of these batteries contributes to a considerable amount of environmentally unfriendly waste every year. My team has invented a device that will reduce such waste. This device is a battery adapter that uses AA rechargeable batteries in place of D-sized batteries in examinations. This innovation is in line with Singapore's move towards a greener environment and also encourages a green lifestyle among staff and students. Now, listening comprehension examinations can be clean and green, as well as help the school to cut costs. Another bronze award goes to Raffles Girls School, with its one-of-a-kind Wallace Environmental Learning Laboratory, all well in short. Wallace Environmental Learning Lab is an outdoor classroom that's situated at the foothill of Bukit Timah Nature Reserve. Students are able to go out to the forest to collect data, carry out research, and then come back to this lab to analyze, to discuss, and to learn more about our natural heritage. This lab is available not only for RGS, but for schools in Singapore who are interested to bring their students out in the field to learn more about nature and our heritage. Lianhua Primary School developed a school-based curriculum innovation termed Scientists at Work, which won the school a bronze award. Scientists at Work is a school-based curriculum designed by a team of our teachers to equip our pupils with the necessary skills to plan and conduct a science investigation. In Scientists at Work, our teachers play the role of research directors while the students take on the role of scientists and carry out science investigative projects. The students will also learn to come up with research questions, conduct investigations, generate their own conclusions and share their findings with their fellow classmates. Through this authentic learning experience, our students will acquire investigation skills that can be transferred and applied to their day-to-day -day problem solving. One of our Silver Award winners is Northland Primary School and its winning project, Bendy Bonds. In March 2009, when we first conducted our Mets at Home workshop for parents, we demonstrated how they could use cupcakes and ice cream sticks to teach number bonds at home. With that idea, we further brainstormed to make the project more durable and user-friendly, thus the inception of Bandy Bonds. Bandy Bonds is a simple manipulative designed for the teaching of number bonds There is a cut above the traditional approach of using the math balance. The concept of number bonds is an important foundation for understanding how numbers are related. Teachers can now demonstrate the concept of parts and whole and link it to the concept of addition and subtraction with the use of bendy bonds. We realised that children become more engaged as they have hands-on experience with the use of this manipulative, especially for students who have difficulty grasping mathematical concepts. Students now become active participants in their own learning and Bendy Bonds maximise learning through discovery. Attaining the Gold Award is the Orbital Resin Casting Project from Ping Yi Secondary School. Ping Yi's design and technology team is committed towards the innovation of new products and processes that allows both teachers and students to improve their teaching and learning. The resin casting process is a traditional method of production commonly taught in schools. Various problems in the production process 
place a limit on the size and shape of the student's ideal design. Alternative solutions, such as the laser cutter, are expensive and difficult to operate even by adults. By adapting professional engineering work processes to the school context, the Orbiter Racing Caster allows students to produce complex and hollow objects economically and easily. This has greatly enhanced design and technology lessons by allowing the students to realise their creativity. Congratulations to all our winners of the Energy School Awards for their excellent innovations. May their creative spirits continue to soar to greater heights.